More than 2 million people will visit Turin through May 23rd to see the linen cloth which, according to tradition, covered the body of Jesus and has turned into one of the most studied objects in the world. To receive, organize, and lead the visitors are 4,000 volunteers who will lend their time and energy so that visits to the Holy Shroud will be special. It's very complicated to distribute and organize the place and work in an efficient manner. The 4,000 volunteers are in charge of public service, security, of information in the offices, and the warm welcome given to all the visitors. The young and not so young have decided to give a little bit of their time so that from the first day, attention given to visitors will be a first class. To treat all the people with friendliness and without arrogance, that's our voluntary service of supervision. This is the spirit the Alpine Corps has wherever it's needed, in Italy or outside the country, to always present itself well and to help anyone who needs anything during an event, in this case with the display of the Holy Shroud. Furthermore, to collaborate in the organization of this grand event is also a very special moment for the volunteers. I became a volunteer by accident, but now after the conferences and the gatherings with the other volunteers, it be, has become a very positive experience that for someone who isn't religious like me, it can bring me closer to the faith. For me, it's a very important event because most likely the Holy Shroud won't be on display again for a long time. I'm part of the Brotherhood of the Holy Shroud, and that's why I'm very proud to be here today. 4,000 volunteers with 4,000 distinct reasons to help with the exposition of the Holy Shroud until May 23rd, a historic event for which it is unknown when it will happen again.